Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. It's your girl Tay. Before we get into what we are doing today, here's a quick PSA. If you guys actually watch this video and you like it, please don't forget to leave a like. Go ahead and leave a comment and subscribe to my channel. I would very much appreciate it. Thank you guys. But yeah, you guys, hi, how are you? I hope you guys are doing great. So in today's video, I'm just gonna be showing you guys how I take my product photos. Simple, right? I have a few different ways that I do it. If you guys haven't seen any of my content I posted recently, whether it's on my Instagram or my TikTok, then I would suggest you guys check it out. I do, I think my content is very good. I think it's so high quality. I think it looks great. And if you guys like what you see, like go ahead and check out my, you know, social media, subscribe, like, comment, share, whatever you want to do, follow. And if you like what you see, then you can come back here to learn how I take those product photos and videos and such, right? So yeah, you guys, so I'm going to show you a few different things that I use. Uh, first, let me just show you a little my little setup, guys, so what I was doing. So I was just cutting fabric before I said, let me just go ahead and make this video. And um, So you know, I got some, oh, excuse that, my baby's not feeling well, y'all, so I got a little, you know, temperature checker. But these are like the strips that I've been cutting. Um, and I usually just cut them with this, but I dope my blade. <sighs> yes, so I had to revert back to the old way I used to do it, which I just use a pen or a pencil or something, draw a line. I use my fabric scissors to cut it, but that's what I had going on, and I watching you know videos and stuff on my tablet. But I'm gonna go ahead and just show you guys what I use to take my photos. So first thing first is tripod, and I also use my uh, camera, uh, which is a Canon G7X Mark II. I'm looking for my phone. And I also use my phone, um, just the back camera though. And this is a Samsung, like one of the newest versions. Excuse the case. So yeah, so I use those, my tripod. I got this from Walmart years ago, like $30. And this is one of the best tripods in the world, y'all. I've tried two other ones, but this, that girl, she is it. And a few other things I use is my softbox lights. I got both of these from Wish. Y'all remember the Wish app? Yeah, I don't know if people still use it, but that's where I got these from. And I always use my backdrop. Oh, that is wrong. That's not. Y'all, this is why I'm using the countdown to launch day, guys. If you don't know, I'm launching my business on July 30th, this year, 2020, at 6 p.m. And I'm so excited, guys. So, if you guys don't know, then my name is Will Tasha Sipio. I am the owner of Brand XX, which is a luxury lanyard brand. Um, uh, so, yeah, I make lanyards, and they are high quality, luxury. They're so pretty, guys. I have so many different styles. So many different styles. I got the long one, and I got like the short version. So that is what I am preparing for. But I'm gonna change that date real quick, and then we're gonna get back into the video. But before I do that, this is like one of the backdrops I always use for my video, and I absolutely love this backdrop. But give me one second, guys. And then um, if you go to my site, uh, if you guys are interested in checking out my site, I do have a landing page where, of course, like I say, you can sign up to be part of the email list to know when we launch and for promotions and stuff like that. But this is how it looks. And it has a timer at the top to tell you when we launch. And this is what I got. Um, this is where the lanyards are going to be. Of course, there's nothing there. It's just, you know, aesthetic so you can get to know my brand, you know, little details about it. That's me, CEO, you know, cute little quotes and stuff like that, you know, to represent me and my brand, more products and stuff like that, picture of me, more about my brand, stuff like that. So that's like my page. You want to sign up on my email list, you can. So I'm going to write down how many days we have exactly 39 days to watch. Woo, Lord have mercy. Oh, it's so nerve-wracking. The closer we get, the more nervous I get. Because so much to be done. So you guys, let's go ahead and get into how I take these photos. All right guys, so the first one is, oh by the way, yes, I got my night gown at home because I'm in the house, like, why would I put an outfit, you know, it's just, you know. So the first one, I usually use natural sunlight and I usually move this background closer to the window, but you know, since it's just, you know, let me give you an example. I don't feel like that's necessary right now. So just imagine this is like lit up with sunlight, right? And I'll take one of my layers. Let's just say, let's take this one because it's one of my favorites. It's the orange snake skin one. It has, um, and I'm trying to make it focus. It has like gold foil. 
gold buckles, gold detailings. It has the black backing, and the small one is the same. These are some of my favorite ones, and these are my personal ones, y'all, and I have had them for months. They so good, y'all, I'm telling you. These are so good. So, I normally just probably hold them in my hand like this, and then I take a picture usually with my, my Canon, but since I'm um, filming on it right now, uh, I just gonna give you an example. So I'll take a picture like, like this, and then when it comes to, or I wear around my neck, and then take a picture in front of the background. That's how I normally do it, and I try my best to always use sunlight. And then I also, another way of me doing it is just on my wrist like so. And I just take a picture like, holding it in my hand. You know, just different poses with the layers. Because you know, because since it's a layer, it's not like I have so many options of what I can do. Like, it's not like lashes or hair. Like, you know what I mean, like you know, with lashes, you can sit there, take a picture of the lash on the eye, and you usually get to go, or you can take a picture of it like on a flat lay, which is another way that I can get to how to take my pictures. But yeah, so that's different ways. So, all right, so that's the first way: sunlight, me holding them, or on my wrist or around my neck is like the first thing. So the next one is flat lay. So let's get into it. Alright guys, so here's another way that I do it, um, which is like flat lace, which means the product is actually laying down. Now I usually, for the most part, have my background the same way. I just put it on the floor, as you can see it's on the floor. And I have like this little bit of something of a sort. And then I usually use a black satin or my white satin or even gold satin, something like that, that match my green colors. I lay it flat like that. And then I usually, and I also got to tell you guys, I also have these things, like for example, these things light up. I'm gonna go ahead and light one of those so you can see. See? So I have these, and there's so many of them. And I usually just use those and some of these green leaves. And I got all this from the dollar store, guys. Like everything. Like all of this stuff is from the dollar store. The, except for the satin. The satin is from Joann's. So I got even these little brick things here. I got them from the dollar store. I put it on um, poster board, and then that's how I made that. And these green leaves and these lime leaves, I got all from the dollar store. And it, it makes such a cute background, guys. Especially when all of them are lit, lit up. And then I take my layer. Let me pick one for this one. I guess we'll do the color, multicolor. Okay, I'm gonna use the multicolor for an example. Let me flip my screen so I can see what I'm doing. So this is a multicolored one, guys. And you can just lay them down like flat like this. I'm gonna, I'm gonna bring you up, guys, closer. But what I like to do for my long layers is this. I flip them in like this. And then I like making hearts with them. Like this. I'm gonna show you guys up close. <sighs> like that. And that's a flat lay. And you can basically take a picture just like this. You get the right angle, the right lighting. You know what I'm saying? Right now the light is a little bright, so I'll fix my exposure, which is like more in depth type of way of taking photos, like your exposure and white balance and stuff like that. But I just lay on flat and take pictures of them like this. Oh, and I also like taking pictures of them like next to each other or flip like this or something like that. You know what I'm saying? Just different ways. Um, because they are layers though, I do like having pictures of me wearing them so people know exactly what they are. Because them laying like this, people can be like, what is that, a belt? What is that, you know what I mean? So yeah, I also have like different tools I use. Let me show you guys. Let's go to my little inventory closet. Sorry, guys, it got a little dark. But this is like my inventory closet. Like stuff down here is like stuff from my old business and stuff I want to sell. Stuff in here, stuff I need for my business, like my shrink, my shrink, um, my heat gun, and you know different little tools. And this tiny box up here, and this uh, this box holds this, my current inventory, such as what would you say? Um. I don't know, like HTV and stuff like that, like different things like that. But this is the stuff that all my photo stuff is in. This is all stuff I use when I take my photos. So I got a green screen. I got these cute little light bulbs. I got that from the dollar store. I got a mouse. I got this. I got this little like holder thing, photo holder. But I use it for the whole my layers. I got so many different like props and tools that I use for my business in there. Um, and yeah, you guys, so that is what I do for my layers and stuff, and I think that's really it, guys. That's the main things I do besides me. Yeah, like, hold on. <laughs> so, yeah, you guys, my background look kind of messy, guys, I know, but that's, like, all my business stuff and stuff, and then, you know, 
so about that. But yeah, you guys, so that's what I really do for my photos. It's really easy. I just basically try my best to use as much natural sunlight when I can. But like I said, I do work. And I get off late. So if I can't do it, if I can't finish everything I need to finish, I just do it at night. And I just use my softbox lights. And I, they work really good. And I got a ring light too. So I got a ring light like this. It has three different colors, three different um, light colors. So it got like white, blue, and like an orange. And it lets you turn the light up or down depending on how much exposure you need. And I got my softball lights like when it's not plugged up. So let me plug up. Oh, see. Can you guys see? You see it? Yeah, okay, you guys see the light, right? So that's like what I use for my um while photo taking and it's super simple and then but the difference the hardest part i say when it comes to taking pictures of my lens is finding a good way to showcase them because they're laying so of course you can wear it on your ridge mirror right neck that's like the main thing but even with that it just seems so i don't know like well obviously you wear like that so i'll be trying to find the cutest ways to showcase my lens at least with social media like for the website of course you know i'll probably just wear it around my neck and we call it a day, but we'll, we'll see. I'm not sure. I haven't decided on how I want my website photos to be just yet. So, so yeah, you guys. I just thought I'd do this quick video of showing you guys how to take product photos. It's really easy. Well, at least how I take my product photos. It's really easy. Just use sunlight. Um, you can stand up and wear your actual product. It just depends on the product you're making. But since mine is something that not everybody, like I don't think nobody's really doing it. Like, well, at least not how I'm doing it. And I know like for the most part you always see it just laid down, like laid flat, right? But I'm trying to find a way to reinvent it, you know what I mean? Cause you know, that's what I do. The same way I did perfume, you know what I mean? So you guys, if you guys are interested in my layers though, and you really think they're super cute, cause they're super cute y'all, like, and it's like really useful. Like everybody has keys to something. Whether it's your locker if you're going in school, or if it's like work keys like myself, or home keys, or car keys, like, it's so cute guys. Like, look at that. Let me see if I can. It even got my little brand logo right here. My brand name, it says Brand X6. It's so cute, guys. I really love my lanyard, y'all, and I know y'all will too. It's really, I don't think I can explain quality. The quality is 100. It's on point, I promise you guys, I promise you. So yeah, you guys, so that's really it. So yeah, you guys, if you want like an in-depth, in-depth, in-depth of me just showing you exactly how I take photos, like, me not talking, me not explaining differently, just showing you exactly like me setting it up, setting up the product, taking the pictures. I would be happy to do a video like that, but this was a quick video explaining it. So, hey guys, thank you guys so much for watching my video. Please subscribe to my channel, guys. I got so many different videos. I think my next video is going to be, what was my next video? Let me see. I got a list, guys, of stuff I need. I have upcoming because I'm really trying to have a successful launch. A successful launch for me is at least selling one thing oh my baby woke up oh you know you feel a little better or but my goal is to sell at least 500 dollars work of product and that'd be so good if i can do that oh my next video at this is i'm going to share my two week progress of me post on social media how i did like how i feel about like the followers i gained the views i received the difference between tiktok instagram i've been posting on tiktok and instagram mainly but i have posts on pictures i have posts on facebook and stuff like that so that's what my next video is gonna be, and the video after that is gonna be like a get to know me, y'all. Like I got all, I got, I got it, I got it ready, okay? I got it planned now, okay? So, yeah, you guys, don't forget to like, comment, and share this. Like, comment, and subscribe to this channel. If you want to share, you can. I don't mind. I, I would appreciate that too. Thank you guys so much. I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.